The merge is one of the hottest topics among the crypto community and one of the most anticipated upgrades in the history of the crypto industry. So, what exactly is this upgrade, and when is it going to launch? Be sure to watch till the end of this video as we're going to explain everything you need to know about it. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the Millionaires Club. Here you'll find promising millionaires determined to learn more about financial markets and business spaces. If you happen to be new here, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button, so you don't miss out on a single video. Now, let's get right into it. Ethereum merge closer than ever. What it means for ETH. For quite some time, Ethereum, the largest and most popular altcoin by market cap, has been developing a software upgrade. The update serves to substantially change Ethereum. It will also have a major impact on digital assets. Although the Ethereum Foundation now refers to it as the Ethereum Merge, it was previously known as Ethereum 2.0 or F2. Before explaining the merge, we need to know a bit about Ethereum blockchains. Currently, two Ethereum blockchains are in use, Mainnet and the Beacon Chain. Mainnet is the blockchain that we are all familiar with, and it's the chain that is currently verifying and processing transactions as well as operating smart contracts. On the other hand, the Beacon Chain is operating in parallel, however, it's now in testing mode. While the mainnet is proof of work, this new blockchain is proof of stake. The merge happens when Ethereum switches from proof of work to proof of stake, and the mainnet chain and the Beacon Chain become one. Technically, one of them becomes the execution layer, and the other one becomes the consensus layer. Instead of using energy intensive mining, the merge secures the network using staked ETH. The main goal of this is to not only increase energy sustainability but also improve security and scalability at the same time. It's a complex, multi-step process to adjust the second largest blockchain from one system to another. It's also essential to carefully consider each decision. The update is expected to solve many problems, keep the network one step ahead of its rivals, and reward those who have supported them during the process and have staked actual value for Ethereum 2.0. So, because of all this, the merge has been in the works for quite some time. According to the latest announcements, the merge is expected to launch on September 19, 2022. Now, let's see what the pros and cons of the merge are. As for pros, Ethereum will have a full transition from proof of work (POW) to a proof of stake (POS) system. Besides, the merge will decrease Ethereum's energy consumption by about 99.95%. Moreover, this update sets the stage for upcoming scaling upgrades like sharding. An upgrade is significant as the merge is not expected to have any cons. In fact, it's expected to bring about a large number of positive changes to the blockchain, improving its efficiency and preparing it for the future. The only cons you can think of is that it won't completely solve the issues the Ethereum network is now experiencing. After the merge, there will be another process called sharding. This is a process that will help the network become ready for Ethereum 2.0 shard chains. Sharding will entirely depend on a functional POS network to run. So, the merge is only the first of five steps in the Ethereum network's development phases. According to Ethereum co-founder Vitalik Buterin, the five developmental phases are the merge, the surge, the verge, the purge, and the splurge. Ultimately, one might ask whether the Ethereum merge will cause a rise in price. This is actually a dicey question to tackle. For those already on the chain, Ethereum merge will open up a world of opportunities, therefore, if it sees an increase in participation, there will undoubtedly be an increase in price, but that will take some time. So, profiting from short-term gains would be quite difficult. However, many experts believe that this can even trigger a 200-500% to rally in the ETH price. But, keep in mind that these are only predictions, and actual events might turn out to be quite different. Remember that the merge is only the first phase in a very long process of development. So, that's basically it. If you enjoyed today's content and found it helpful, make sure to go ahead and smash that like and subscribe button for more crypto news and updates. And now, what do you suppose will happen to ETH prices after the merge is launched? Let us know your opinions, experiences, and arguments in the comments section below.